30 days. Task finish, increase control in county. Good. How, what's the cons? Oh, okay. The, con the control is actually fine. I thought it was going to go down considering the fact that, you know, we took over. I guess a aim. Just keep. No, actually, just organize levies. Let the other people actually gain control in their own lands. We have control in our own. So that's one additional piece of land there. Boom. 98. We're almost there. Oh, God. You have a lot of allies, and I don't like that. I really, really don't like that. But you pretty much already called all of them in, so... It doesn't really mean anything for you. Oh, is the army coming back? Oh, it actually went to attach itself to that 200-unit army. While I appreciate him trying to, I guess, keep that army safe... <laughs> that was just weird. Um... Move the additional onagers into there. See if that helps. It does not help. It's still too high. What we can also do is possibly give you a... No. Yeah. There. Military engineer. Maybe that'll additionally help. Four more months. But I think that in one month we're actually going to be ending this war. I wish to... What are you under control by? Like, what are you actually under control by? Oh, they're actually trying to take it back. Good. Wait, there's their army. Two months. And I'm pretty sure that by the end of this month we're going to be able to force... Yeah, exactly. Oh, he's going to be uh, have to pay us. Hell yeah. Enforce demands. There we go. Alright. So, do we, technically speaking, have a... We do not have a truce with him. Does he have a truce with us? He does. Okay, so we don't have to worry about the Umayyads for a while. Let's see who we do have to worry about. Auvergne. You are completely alone over there. Mualad the Andalusian. I hope you realize I am taking your lands. And I am taking this guy's lands as well. These are just one county miners at this point. What is going on? <laughs> Alright. Yep, bring our armies home. Okay. Additional taxes. I mean, dude, we are just swimming in money at this point. Uh, what do you still need to make Francia? Actually, that's a very good question. Let's actually check. Uh, we need 95 de jure counties. We currently have 81, so we're quite well on the way to that. We need 1,000 gold. We have that, and we <laughs> probably will continue having that for quite a bit. Let's see. Where do we get... That is 14 additional counties that we need. So that's one. That's two. That's three. Uh, Lotharingia, I believe, also belongs under Francia. Well, at least part of it. So that's going to be a couple right there. One, two, three, four. I don't know which... Wait. I need to check. Champagne. Yeah, we can take Champagne. So that's going to be... One, two, three, four, five additional counties. So that's five, six, seven, eight. Um, and I guess we're either going to have to fight the Umayyads or we're going to have to fight Burgundy. Uh, either way, we are certainly going to be fighting that. And I th think Italy... Wait, does that piece of land over there also belong under Francia? Yes, it does, because it's the entirety of Burgundy. So we could also, we will also be able to attack uh, Italy afterwards to essentially create Francia as it's supposed to be. There. This band. This band. Our armies are now. <laughs> Good God, we can have almost 10k. That is. That is amazing. Our armies certainly are growing, and I am loving it. It's probably also because we do have a um, very, very military-like, martial-like ruler currently. 
I mean, he is a badass. Let's just admit it. He is definitely a badass. No, don't you dare be sick. Do we have... Wait, 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 wait. Court physician. Um... Uh, 23, my wife, uh, could you be... No, I can't actually ask you to be my court physician, can I? That's a 16. He's deceitful. I don't like that, that he's deceitful. And he's actually my brother as well. He probably wouldn't appreciate me very much right now. Uh, get a physician. Go, start the surge. Go, 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 go. I cannot have Enzo die. Good God, no, please. You're 22. Survive. Don't you dare die. Huh. Invite knights. We have enough prestige now to do exactly that. I can also call for a hunt. Let's do that. Let's lower our stress levels a little bit. Hunt. We ride. I get what? My vassal duke is the first one to see it. The majestic stag is hard to distinguish from its surroundings, but it's observing us. Because we're lazy, it actually increases our stress. Court physician. That's a 15, that's a 10. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, Judith. We press on. Night has arrived. Uh, Mualadi Basco, I'm not interested. Ransom. Sure, I didn't even realize I still have prisoners that are ransomable. Apparently we did. Uh, let me actually... Are you Mualadi Catalan? I can negotiate release. I can demand conversion from you. Also gain weak hook. Let you go. Valdensian Bavarian. Demand conversion immediately and that. Go. Uh, Mualadi Octan. Demand conversion will not accept. Fine, then stay here. Muvaladi Andalusian. Demand conversion will not accept. Fine. Be in there. I'm just gonna start converting everybody and sending them back home. To see, uh... <laughs> to see what happens. You never know. Some of them might actually persuade others to join the ranks of... What? Realm will lose land when Vassal dies. Which one? Oh, that was a warning already before. Why did he die at 23? I'm the cause of it? Am I the cause of it? I think I'm the cause of it. I think he was one of our knights. Speaking of knights... Wait, I can only have eight? That's not too good. Our knights are relatively good, though. They're pretty good, yeah. 25, 22, 22. Heck to the yeah. Um... We're waiting to see hook gain. Okay, okay. How's the hunt going? There we go. A good kill. Should lose a little bit of mistress. We return home reinvigorated. I didn't lose a single point of stress in that. Why? Oh my god, laziness. Alright, fine. I guess we're just gonna be kind of teetering on the edge of... ...becoming too stressed. Okay, so over and over here, declare war, holy war for county. All titles held by Mualadi rulers are seized, and any Catholic rulers are vassalized by you. I hate that they can do a conquest, but we can't do a conquest against him. Fabricate, go. 11 months? I'll wait. What about this? Can I attack you? Also only in a holy war. Uh, I mean, this guy is beaten, but he's not... ...battered enough. Not to mention, a whole bunch of these would probably join in and on that war. If we actually do a holy war. That's why I don't like holy wars against such a strong enemy. Or rather, such a strong faith. We're good, though. We're good. A lot of the Valdensian lands are now under our control. Slowly but surely, they should start getting converted. That should be converted. That, 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 yeah. These are the last two pieces of Valdensian lands. This dude already managed to convert Auvergne. Like, what the heck? <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna be it for Valdensianism. Excellent. 
I do like that. Uh, what is this? Tiles created, not endorsed by Archbishop. Mm, I am currently swaying... Our spy master. One more sway and I'll start swaying the Archbishop. I mean, honestly, the short reign will go away anyway. Plus, yeah, we are faithful, so that also helps us. Probably don't have to worry about him. Uh, what about you? I can declare war. Uh, oh, wait, but it's a... What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, that has to be claimed. Yes. But this... Nah, that's Muvaladi as well. Damn it! But this guy is not Muvaladi. He's a Valdensian. So, I actually can just declare a holy war. For the entire duchy, I guess. Uh... It doesn't really make sense to go for the duchy, I suppose, so we'll just go for the county. It costs us less. We don't really gain anything more from it if we do the ducal conquest. Um, yeah, I think that's actually enough. He has like 200 units. <laughs> this is more than enough. <laughs> this is just gonna be a quick grab. Excellent. And we've already captured the dude. Do you even have any money? You do have some money, so we can actually ransom you. Get the 50 gold. Have the 50% still with us. Siege this down. See if we can get something else to ransom to you. <laughs> After which, we're good. We're good. Uh, our son is still sick. Can I not... No. A point is court physician. No. Like, we have a court physician now. I need her. Why do you hate me? This figured Catholicism ver uh, is hostile. What the heck are you? You're Valdensian! Demand conversion. Tom, um, you. Ay, 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 ay. Didn't even notice that I took a heretic as my court physician. And she hates me, so that's not exactly a good idea to have her there. Uh. No. Restore inheritance. No. Appoint a court physician. There. He's at 100 now. He's not going to kill us for it, most likely. Try making more allies. Yeah, that's what I was just looking at. Oh, wait. He's not sick anymore. Excellent. Okay. Enzo survived. Enzo survived. Let's see. You are... Wait, no. That's his kid. We need you to marry something strong and powerful. Alliance power, let's go. Uh, alliance with High Chieftain of Balaton, Tolna, Desperate of Hellas. County, 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 good god. None of these are actually powerful. Uh, Sienna, I mean, you're a strong, you'd be a strong ally in any day of the week, really. Italy, I don't want to be an ally with. Do you have, okay, he doesn't have any kids. He doesn't have any children. Um keep track of this character let's see if he manages to get a kid king of Siena king Bernard of Lotharingia he's already dead so we can unpin that we just want to make sure that we keep an eye on him so that when he does have a kid if it's a son we immediately offer our daughter's hand in marriage and get that alliance with Sienna going again. Jesus Christ, the papacy is actually starting to spread. What is this? <laughs> Who am I supposed to make an alliance with if this is what the papacy is all about? Croatia essentially is now papal. Interesting. Interesting. Now, this is going pretty quickly. That's pretty nice. Da -da 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 -da. Court physician hired. All is good. Everything's going well. Your culture has discovered communal government. Do explain to me what that is. Should be somewhere over here, right? Mm, no, 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 no. Is it here? Communal government. Hello. Counties now reach the maximum of existing, existing development penalty at 35 development. I'm not sure how we got that. Because we're definitely not... We're focusing on that. We're focusing on household soldiers. 
which will increase the size of the men-at-arms regiments to plus three, plus the max number of men-at-arms regiments will be plus one. So we will have another uh, men-at-arms regiment. Next, we could probably go for the mangonels and swap our onagers for the mangonels, considering the additional damage they are able to pull on stronger locations, such as uh, Alto Aragon over there with the massive fort level six. I know I'm saying massive and there are probably stronger forts, but you guys know what I mean. What is this? Defending against Emir Wahab of the Salamita Emirate in the war against Su for Sultan Bilal's claim in the Sultanate of Andalusia. Ooh! He actually has the upper hand as far as the military goes, unless this guy actually calls in all of his allies. Let's see what happens. Yeah! Sorry, needed a drink. I've been talking a whole lot without actually hydrating. I mean, this dude has allies as well. He might actually end up being the new Sultan. He's got an 8. He's got a 5. No, wait, that's not the main king. He's got an 8 as well. Okay, so... The power... Should not change that much. Dishonorable villain. Yeah. Should all be good. No matter which one uh, uh, remains king. Will you ransom her? You will. For 25 gold? Let's do it. Do, 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 and we still enforce our demands. Boom. So be it. Alright. We can actually keep that one domain just for the time being. Because why not? How much longer till this happens? Seven months. Okay, so who is our next target? Listen to us. <laughs> Agent 47 over here. Who's my next target? Cambre. Would you be willing to be my vassal? You would not. Could I simply attack you? Count who? Oh, that's a claim of yours? Vastly inferior? Is she that strong or does she have allies? She has an ally. Betty. Wait, but Betty is within my lands anyway, so they're definitely not coming in to help. So that's 1,100 units. Uh, yeah, I'm, I don't see why I would not go for that. Uh, in the Aishian claim of Prince Bishopric of... Okay, so those are like small... Oh no, that's the entirety of Utrecht over there. Defending against Luxembourgian claim. Oh, now Luxembourg is attacking them. Like, holy... <laughs> They're attacking somebody while simultaneously being attacked by Lotharingia. I mean, when all is said and done, I can just do this. I can just do this. Gain that gigantic part of land right there from him. From Lotharingia. Do you have allies? You have zero allies to help you. So that's a war I can do. I can. Uh, we can probably simultaneously do Cambrai as well. And in the meantime, Auvergne will be claimed, and then we can start claiming this piece of land right here as well. Yep, I think that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so Lotharingia declare war, de jure, duchy. Boom, and at the same time, I'm just gonna go ahead and claim... Oh, we don't have the... We don't have the prestige for that. So, you know, this is a problem I have not faced in quite a while. Not having the prestige to do the things we wish to do. Then again, I could simply, you know, we could simply just create a bunch of titles. That's five titles we can create. We could simply just create a bunch of titles. Um and increase our prestige that way. Like, if we create Armanak over here, we gain 300 for 250, like, I'll just create it right now. And what's more, I'm actually gonna give the land, or rather the title, to this man. Uh... Why can't I? He's literally- Ah, there we go. That you've automatically. 
There. You're now a duke. Congratulations. And now we have the prestige we need. We are still making plenty of gold. So we are good. We are good. Okay. Start raising up an army. Raise all. I'm just looking at the money. Like, we... <laughs> Once again, we've raised our entire army. And we're still in a positive. I absolutely love this. Alright, go and take Cambre. This army starts moving down. Starts taking. Knight has arrived. Are you Catholic French? You are, and you're a 21. You are 51 years old. But, quite honestly, I'll take it. Wait, it was 51, right? Yeah. Okay. If it was 61, I would have said definitely not. I kind of wish we just had some younger guys coming in. Wait. Combre. Why doesn't it say that we're at war? I literally declared war on you. Did I not? Was I... Oh, no, I didn't. Something must have caught my eye, I guess? I completely whiffed that. I did not declare war like I thought I would. I did. Sorry. Like I thought I did. Langre is under siege. How long is that gonna take? Seven months. How long is this gonna take? Two months. How long is this one gonna take? Five months. I mean, I already have a plan what to do. As soon as that's done, I'm gonna start moving the army over there. There we go. First piece of land. Excellent. Uh, and we will place the Onagers in the control of this army right here. Meanwhile, this army... Should be able to split in half, and the army that does not control any onagers goes here. We combine these two armies, and that is 6k versus their 36k. It should certainly work just fine. What we could also do... Is actually just send all of our... knights and whatnot with them as well and men at arms just to increase the quality of the army there we go oh uh, his opinion of us okay that's 92 i think we're good for now let's start swaying him should just take one sway and it'll be fine Oh, they're moving out. Nice. Continue. We are getting some prisoners. Also good. Let's see. That's 50 gold for me. That's 10 gold for me. And that's another 10 right there. Do feast for more prestige, my opinion, and bring dwarves. I am still the president of the Dwarf Fan Club. <laughs> that you are. That you are. Nobody can really... Nobody can really take that title away from you. <laughs> there we go, prisoner. Ransom her as well. Excellent. Task finish, fabricate claim, see it done. Absolutely. Oh, and because he's actually a good guy with a 19... It actually only cost us, like, 63 gold to get that claim right there. Alright, now go and claim that. So that we can do a claim war. A conquest war. Not a holy war. Uh, enemy combatant captured. Ransom for 50. Excellent. Anybody else? Nope. Uh... I think we just move our army right back in and start sieging down again. Excellent. Hans. Uh, Catholic French 915. 
I mean, I'll... I'll recruit you. Might as well. It's only a nine, but hey. He's still young. <laughs> there we go. Combine. Can we at least get a commander? There we go. With some military engineering. Over here would be a nice military engineer as well, if we could have one. Duke Folks of Orléans could. But we already have a hundred auditors over here, so it's gonna go pretty quickly. I've been corresponding with your Chancellor, Duke Henry, and I must say that I have come to see you in a new light. Perhaps even... Perhaps you are even someone that I one day would be proud to call my friend. Who are you? Oh, Jeffrey of Italy. Um... I mean, I'm fine with you liking me, but I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna be declaring war on you because I want that land. That's 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 French land, my friend. Whether you like it or not, that's French land. <laughs> Engineer for destruction. There we go. Siege weapon effectiveness plus forty. Um, no question is, do we go down anything else? I don't really think we do. I think we go for stewardship now. No, we cannot. Um, how, when can we actually? Uh. doesn't really say when I can swap focus. I would love to be able to swap focus. Uh, Gallant leader prowess plus four. Knight effectiveness could be pretty good. Military or diplomacy. Enzo should go intrigue. I mean, diplomacy would be pretty good as well, yeah. I just want to go... Um, I want to go stewardship because uh, being able to control more land, being able to have more income, being able to have more armies, especially during these times, is, or rather, especially in this game, I consider to be one of the better things. Uh, Bailey has been constructed in Paris. But yeah, we're definitely going to have some fun with the, uh, with the, the, the intrigue as well, of course. Uh, move the army to Shalon over there. Where's the enemy army, by the way? <laughs> there it is! Um, split in half and go straight for that army. Defend it in case they try to go for it. Ah, they're gonna go around. They realize. Just combine those two armies, that's fine. Uh, neighboring ruler will... Uh, what? Lost war. Duke has lost war against High Chieftain Visby in the Visby conquest of... Another Asatru dude. Oh god. Oh my god, what is happening with Sweden? What is this mess? Why are they here? They should not be here. We really need to become Francia so that, uh... <laughs> so that we can take out the Iberians. Or at least start making our... Actually, no. Once we're Francia... What do you guys think? Do we do the Reconquista or do we go to... Uh, first to re uh, remake the Holy Roman Empire over there? I don't really care if Sweden controls th th three quarters of, um, of Ireland. I just want to make sure they have no lands within Europe. In the part when you need to fight the Byzantines, you could try to kidnap the Emperor at the beginning of the war. I guess so, yeah. HRE. Yeah. Probably. Once we take, uh, once we create actual Francia, yeah, like, I don't know if the Umayyads are gonna have the balls to attack or anything. We might do one or two wars against them just to kind of weaken them further so that they never actually think about doing that. Uh, like, you know, actually being aggressive towards us anymore. And we'll just go towards the HRE. I think that's, I think that's a good idea, yeah. Um, Bailey constructed, yes. Uh, Saumur. Construct that. Melun. Melun. This is what we constructed. Construct the rest of it. Here we go. I think we're gonna get another... Another hostage or two over here to possibly pay, uh, make him pay for. We'll see. Otherwise, sieges are, pro uh, are also quite... Quite a nice way to get gold. He's gonna try and retake that, but we're gonna stop him from doing that. 
by sending in... this army as well. Let's go. There we go. Prisoner taken in siege. Ransom. I mean, hey. 10 gold is 10 gold. 80%. It'll probably go up a little bit more after this battle as well. Our knight maimed their knights. Good. For once we're actually... Oh, we have them. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Right. Completely forgot that we actually had some mercenaries. What was it? 17 or 1800 strong or something like that? Do both if you can? I mean, we'll see. Perhaps. Perhaps we can. Uh, yo, that's, I mean, that's a king. I am going to ransom him, but only because I know that this war is going to be over momentarily as soon as we actually get this as well. And we're, we're just in case, going to be moving our army over here as well. There we go, yeah. We're still at 100% even. Despite everything. Perfect. Disband all. Boom. Uh, do we have any prisoners? We do have a bunch of prisoners over here. You. You. Can't ransom you just yet, but we'll be able to. So yeah, instantly we're gonna get right back up to like 800 gold.